All right, Shalom. First and foremost, I'd like to start off by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honor to the apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. This is the brother Yahweh Allah from GMS Chicago coming, coming back at you with another lesson. Uh, and today I'm going to do a response video to um, the brother GMS uh, Amath Bah. Uh, well, this channel is GMS News and Math, um, entitled Esau speaking on Israelites compares to KKK. You know, it seems like uh, in this video, you have these Edomites, these older, <laughs> old Edomites. Um, it seems to be, uh, I guess it's a, a news station. And um, they're commenting on, you know, what they call, uh, you know, the, the quote unquote Hebrew Israelite movement. Which, you know, it's not, it's more of a prophecy and, and a fulfillment of prophecy more than, you know, than it's just a movement as, you know, these Edomites uh, have out here in the world, you know. And uh, I'm going to make a few comments through it, through the spirit, you know, because this, this, this is a, <laughs> this is a beautiful news, man. You know, these news, uh, uh, the, the word is getting out there, man. You know, I was watching the uh, uh, video uh, with uh, the elder Kazak, um, and he made a statement that really resonated with my spirit, man. You know, and uh, what he said was that we're we're uh, pushing out the vibe. You know, pretty much. You know, what he says that we're pushing out uh, the vibration of being an Israelite, man. You know, we're actually impacting the world, man. You know, the the world. Uh, that's what it was. He says the world is different because uh, of us doing the work, man. You know, and that was the video on man doing the work, you know, pushing pushing forth this word, man. You know, and, and, and these Edomites know it, man. They're, they're watching. The world is watching, you know, and this is evidence of that, man. You know, but as I was watching the video and listening to what these Edomites were saying, uh, um, it's laughable, man. You know, because uh, the, uh, everything that they're saying is conjecture and simply uh, 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 um uh, uh, shedding uh, a negative light upon Israelites, man. Okay? You know, and that shows the hypocrisy of these people, man. Because everybody else is entitled to have, uh, quote-unquote, their own religion. Which, we don't have a, a religion, it's a nationality. Right? But uh, as soon as uh, 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 blacks, Latinos, or Native Americans get together on one accord, now it's, it's easy to, 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 to talk down upon that. All right, so uh, I'm gonna play. You know, let them speak a little bit. Here it goes. They were claiming to be the rip, saying that but a big lie created by the white man to enslave the black people. That sounds very racist to me. A uh, design to enslave the black people. But what I really hear. Uh, them preaching is nothing but pure hatred and in my opinion it's not any different than the Ku, Ku Klux Klan okay so uh, I will, you know that's really what um, uh, 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 pu pushed me to do this lesson you know pulled me to do this lesson was uh, her comment she said that it, it seems like pure hatred you know and then later on the know, black panthers the not Later on, she goes uh, to quote that it's not that, that the movement is not scriptural. I'm gonna see if she'll say it right now. This of the Black Lives Matter liars and hypocrites. They're all racist. Uh, So-called Christians from the black community are backsliding at an alarming rate. And um, joining this movement, and it grieves me to see the community. I'm a white Christian living in London, uh, England, but I'm sad to say that this uh, belief has reached this shores as well. All right, well, she's going to say it later on, but she's she's quoting, she said that, it, that it, it seems like pure hatred, you know, but the thing is, is that the real Hebrew Israelites, they have, a, 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 you know, they, they have reason to, to, to hate right now, man, you know. Uh, uh, they're under the Babylon, the 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 daughter of Babylon's captivity, man. You know, 
And, and, and this, and because, you know, she's her proud, you know, she's so proud. She goes to make that statement that, um, that it's, it's, it's all, it's, it's about hate, you know, when, you know, uh, uh, and, and, she, and then on top of that, she says it's not scripture, but the scripture says, uh, uh there's a time to hate. So what does she know? This is uh, Ecclesiastes. You know what? I'm gonna start from verse one, Ecclesiastes three and one to everything. There is a season and a time to every purpose under heaven. So everything has a time, a time to be born and a time to die, a time to plant and a time to pluck up that which is planted. So if you notice, this is um, is giving opposites, you know, uh, the balanced opposites. It says a time to kill and a time to heal, a time to break down and a time to build up, a time to weep and a time to laugh, a time to mourn and a time to dance. All right. So there's a time for all these things, you know, because right now they like to say, oh, God loves everybody. God is all love. Hey, the scriptures speak contrary to that. OK, and it proves that she has no reason. She has no qualifications to say that that's not scriptural, that that that, that uh, black um, blacks, Latinos, Native Americans. Hey, man, they're the real Hebrew Israelites, man. All right. You know. And, and that's according to scripture. Uh, um, and, and the fact that, that we're out here proclaiming our heritage and and, and, uh, uh, and letting you know that you Edomites, uh, um, are, uh, that you so-called white people are Edomites, you know, and, and uh, you guys are going to be brought down low. Hey, that's righteous, man. You know, that, that that's having righteous hatred, hatred man. I'm going to read verse 8. It says, a time to love and a time to hate. A time of war and a time of peace. And we're in a time of hate. We're in a time of war. You know? They, uh, 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 th this kingdom is getting ready to, to be brought down, man. You know? The, the, the transfer of power is at hand. All right? The destruction is at hand. You know? And, 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 and that's what the scripture says, man. So this girl, this lady, she obviously doesn't know what she's talking about. Talking about that it's all about pure hatred. Was well, this is the time to be to hate? Okay. I'm gonna. I'm a, yeah, um, yeah. What did this belief originate from? As I said, I don't not familiar with uh, a little bit about it, but um, apparently it's just something that's on YouTube. Does any guys, do either one of you, know anything about this? You know, I've read in history that there. There are some uh, Hebrews in Africa that are the black race. Ethiopia. Ethiopia. But I, I've never... And, and that, again, proves that they don't know the scriptures. You know, I'll just get that real quick. Because they're, they're quick to credit Ethiopians as Israelites. Uh, um... Oh, it's a, it's a different scripture. Let me get it real quick. Bear with me. You know. Yeah, Amos 9 and 7. Ye are, are ye not as the children of the Ethiopians unto me, O children of Israel? saith the Lord, have I not brought up Israel out of the land of Egypt and the Philistines and Cathor and the Syrians from Kerr? So this this right here says they, that they are like the Israelites, but there is a separate, there's a separation. All right. So the Ethiopians are not Israelites. All right. There may be some scattered because Israel uh, among them, because Israel was scattered across the four corners of the earth. But as a whole, uh, originally, the Ethiopians are not Israelites, but they're quick to accredit them. But but as soon as uh, some black people, you know, uh, uh, say, say, say that, um, you know, because that's how they look down upon, you know, uh, you know, blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans, man, the real Hebrew Israelites, man. You know, as soon as one of us start claiming it, no, now it's a problem. But they can accept an Ethiopian, right? No, the, the proof, that proves that they don't know the scriptures, man. There's obviously a, se a separation. Then in terms of uh, why it's that way and, and what do they believe and teach, I've never researched that. But this doesn't sound like a, a true, even Jewish uh take off of, of the of Ju true Judaism. It sounds like it's more of a racist uh, uh, approach to, like uh, to uh, 
condemning Christianity, but uh, certainly doesn't sound biblical. No. And, and, and Judaism is... He said it definitely doesn't sound difficult, uh, biblical, but you don't know, though. ...is not uh, the way to get saved. At this point, a person only gets saved and has a right relationship with God through... You know, because he, he was saying that it was a uh, racist. Well, look at look at what the Bible says. You know, this is these these are basic scriptures here. You know, um, let me see. You know, these are basic scriptures, and, and, and um, they want to be quick to say that it's not scriptural, but they don't know the scriptures. This Deuteronomy fourteen and twenty. For thou art a holy people unto Yahweh thy power, and the Lord hath chosen thee to be a peculiar people unto himself above all the nations upon the earth. So here the Bible tells you, you know, uh, um, that, that the Israelites are a people that are above all the other people. So they want to say, oh, no, it's, it sounds racist. You know, that that's because they are of this world, man. That's that That's his new world thing, man. You know, but the Most High has chosen himself a peculiar people that it's above all the people, man. You know, the, this scripture right here sounds kind of racist, you know, but that that just goes to show that these uh, white people, so-called uh, these re, uh, actual Edomites, um, they're, they're just devils, man. They go after uh, 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 the opinions of, of what they have set up, man. Opinions of men. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm going to keep playing this. Accepting Jesus Christ as their personal Savior, and and so this certainly doesn't sound biblical. Uh, it, well, I know it's not biblical. Oh, and, oh she knows it's not biblical. Uh, but I tell you what we'll have to do on this one. We'll have to uh, maybe come back tomorrow and give you some more information. Oh, she knows it's not uh, biblical, but she doesn't have information on the group that she's talking about that she knows is not biblical. If you don't have the information, how can you make that decision? This, this is a damn devil, man. You know? And, and, and what the other devil said, he said they, you only have to accept who they call Jesus Christ as your own personal Lord and Savior, right? Well, check this out. Here in um, in uh, the book of uh, John, chapter 1, verse 14, it says, and the word was made flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory as the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. So who is the only begotten of the Father? It's who the, uh, the people ignorantly call Jesus Christ, which his real name is Yahawashai, who he's coming back to destroy this place. All right. It says, so the word was actually made into flesh, man. All right. So so our, our Lord and Savior, Yahawashai, he's actually the word, man. All right. And, and, and how he said, oh, you have to accept him. OK, that's how you accept him by accepting the word. What's the scripture? What is the scripture says? And we just read the scriptures. There's a time to hate. Uh, uh, Israel is above the other nations. So this woman, she doesn't know what she's talking about. You know, uh, it, 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 it's not uh, there's a time for hatred. And this is the time for it, you know. Uh, Esau Edom, the so-called white man, he's getting exposed, uh, and he's gonna be fully exposed. Uh, 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 you know, um, uh, of that he's the devil, man. You know, and that he's been having the the Hebrew Israelites under captivity, man. Okay, so it's a time to hate, and and it's gonna be shown that that, that the Most High he he uh he likens Israel over all the nation uh, all the other nations, man. You know, and it's going to be the it's, and it's going to show forth upon the elect of the of, 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 of the Israelites, man. OK, and that's soon to come. man. All right. Let me get this other scripture. This is uh, Isaiah 8 and 20 to the law and to the testimony. If they speak not according to this word, it is because there is no light in them, you know, and, and um. You know, and, and that's the point, man. That's how you accept, you know, who they say, Jesus Christ. But that's not his name. You, you, and you got to accept it in his correct name, Yahawashai, man. As it is written, there is no other name under heaven where you must be saved, man. Okay? 
But 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 that's the point. They they're talking about that it's hate, it's racist, you know, and it's not scripture. Those three sentences uh show three sentences show that they have no understanding. All right? So, you know, um uh, I just intended it to be a quick lesson. Hopefully with that, um, the elect out there was edified, you know, edified, you know, wh whom it was meant to. And um, I'm going to end by giving all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh, Baha Shem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone who rule and teach well. And Shalom to the elect out there pushing out this word in truth and in sincerity. Hey, man, these, these Edomites, they don't know what they're talking about, man. You know, it's being shown that they're devils and, and, and the veil is going to be uh, 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 shown, man. The veil is, is going to be taken off. And everyone's going to know who, who's the devil, man. You know, it, it, that vibration is out there, man. You know, the truth is going to is going to come out to the four corners of the earth. And and, and then, you know, uh, um, shall, shall uh, uh, salvation come, man. OK. So, you know, with that, I'm going to say Shalom and a Baba ball, man. We almost out of here.